Mark. Grat. Your independent census consultants. consultants coming to you live <laughs> from the dining room. Where you been? You're off your game. <laughs> well, I've been called worse. You weren't called anything. You were just told you were off your game. Oh. That's all. Okay. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Yes. We are here for your entertainment as mm -hmm. well as to share. And tonight, we are going to unbox. We have a 19.90 pound box right there. That we're going to open up with you and share what we have. We have not seen or felt or smelled any of the things in this box, I don't think. No? I'm not sure I know what. I, I think I know what's in there, but I'm not 100% sure that I know what's in there. So, ready? We're going to find out. Excuse the paper noise. Here we go. Ready? Ready. With every order, you get a what's packing supposed slip. To be in your box. Pardon the noise. Nothing is on back order. She got a bunch of scent circles. They're all my hero scent circles. My hero. So I will tell you that we had a party open. We added some products, and based on what I'm seeing so far, this was from the Monday Glamorous launch. So we have a couple orders for a couple friends, and then we have a couple things for our personal selves. A lot of paper. I'm really excited. So if you ordered in the last seven to eight days, your goodies have just arrived. So we got some counter clean, some bathroom cleaner, dish so soap. This is a bundle right here. Where? This one's a clean bundle. This? These three? Yep. And okay. then this is, okay. So we have a counter clean, lemon verbena for one of our beautiful customers. This stuff is amazing. And then we have a clean bundle, which is your dish soap. It's amazing. There you go. In lemon verbena, a, another counter clean, and a bathroom cleaner. Folks, for any of you that live out where you have a well, I know that there are people that are very cautious of what they put in their drain or what they flush down the toilet. Our stuff does not have chemicals. So it is... It's septic safe. Septic safe. I was going to say sewer safe. <laughs> Potato, potato. Septic sounds a little less gross. So if you watch this to the end, drop a potato in the comment <laughs> section for us. There you go. All right. This is a hint of what's in the box. We have three scent packs. If you know what goes with a scent pack, you know what's in this box. You ready? And remember, this was from the Glamorous launch. Mm. And we shared last week that it was coming out on Monday. And I said that there was one thing for certain I was getting. Do you want to do that first? No. It doesn't matter. So this is Gretchen's. You open it. It's yours. This is Gretchen's, so I'm going to open it. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. There's bow ties and sunglasses. Oh, this is so oh cute. My oh my gosh. gosh. Seriously, this is darling. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. Look at him. Spiffy the sloth. Look at him. He is <gasps> darling. He's got that. Um, He's got Otis fuzz. Yes. But what did you say? Helmet head. He's got a helmet head. He's got head. helmet head and. What's this called? He's, leg? He's bow legged. Corduroy? Corduroy! <laughs> Maybe I'll name him Roy. Roy the Corduroy. Isn't he yeah, cute? cute? Look at that. He he's that fresh out the so box. weird. But we never get him with so much fuzz. This, this literally this is guy, like, he's been rolling around in Otis. He is such a cuddle bug. Like the way, it's like holding a newborn baby. Hey, where's the scent pack go? Oh, yes. For those of you that don't know, there is a zipper. Open. You shove your scent pack in there. Zip it up. Shove it in there. <laughs> zip it up. And, and then you have a smelly good buddy. Yep. And if you ever want to wash your buddy, you just take your scent pack out. Wash, wash it. 
Wash your buddy, not stunt pack. That's <laughs> or wash stunt pack too. Or I don't know what will happen, so that's on you. So again, so cute. Show us feet. What's his name? Sid. Or Spiffy. Spiffy. Oh, I might call him Sid. Look at that. You said you were gonna call him. Hmm. She's named him three times already, and it's I can't okay. even remember. He's cute. He's very cute. He's got a cute little sparkly bow tie. He has He's got no ears. Sensi. So he doesn't listen. Written on the bottom of his foot. So there's two of him in this box. I have to see the picture. There's there's his cousin. So Sensi. Isn't that cute? So stinking cute. His little bow tie is darling. He is adorable. He's, he's mine. Okay, that's hers. Now Marges. Oh boy. Oh, oh boy. her packaging. This is you to a stinking T. Look at that. Fantastic. Alrighty. So this is Posh. Yeah. Posh the poodle. Now I do not have a poodle. We have Otis that is a great Pyrenees. And we will probably never have a poodle. Not because we don't like poodles. I actually we actually found a little Maltese. Pomeranian poodle or something the other day. She was darling. She and was. Otis was a perfect host. He was so cute. So this guy's thirty five dollars. U S. And he's still available, as of right this second. Oh, oh my gosh. She's cuter in person. <laughs> Seriously. I don't know what it is with this fuzz. That's so Seriously, weird. she's adorable. Guys, she, she seriously has a helmet head. Okay, this is what Otis looked like right here, yes, but white when he this, was a puppy. This here, exactly. Not even kidding. This. Why is she bald in the back? He didn't have a bald spot back. No, he did not. But this is exactly what he looked like. And this is exactly what she did to him. Yeah, <laughs> this is what we do to him all the time. Look at this little coat. She's got shiny, what is this stuff called? Silk. Silk. On the inside, it's not real silk. But look at this little coat. Oh, she She's is. She's got corduroy. Her little legs are corduroy. She is so cute. Her little jacket. She has a necklace. She has a bow. She has a bow. She has a little oh. bow. She's cute. For those of you that love stuff like this, you would not Seriously. be disappointed. She is so beautiful. Where's her Where's her scent pack going? Her scent pack is going to go right behind her little coat. She's her got vest. Little, She's got a vest. Oh, a little vest. She's got a little pouch. I'll put that in there. She's got a tail. She's got a little tail. Oh, that's a little so tiny cute. One. And poodles do have little tiny tails. They're not very big. So, this is Posh the Poodle. So cute. She's very cute. She's beautiful. She's cuter She's eyelashes. than Look at those. In, per, or, uh, in the catalog. Smile. I thought her. she was darling when I saw her. I did. I. But she looks cuter than that picture. That picture's cute, though. It is cute, but she's cuter than she that is. picture. So she's $35 US, $35 US. Again, she is also still available, so she has not sold out yet. With the holidays starting to come around and people kind of getting in that shopping spirit, I could see her, I could even see mm -hmm. uh, Spiffy selling out. They are cute. They are great gifts. I'm not even... And they're part of a six buddy collection. So you may want to... there's going to be four more coming out at some point. We don't know when. Yeah. It is warm. It's... It's very windy out, but it's warm. So, sorry I keep on fanning myself. She picks the hottest seat. I got the hot seat. I told her I'd sit over there, but she refuses the offer. I rolled my eyes at you. <laughs> oh, they're going to get stuck that way. That's why you stir all the time. All right. Whoa. So we have one of the shiny bags, which what does that mean? So I know there's a six pack of wax for one of our customers in here. Please hold. Crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. Oh, this one's extra sticky. It's, it's like, all right, that's good enough. That's good enough. We're going to. So the Glamorous Collection did come with a Glamorous You wax bundle that was $25 US. It was a five bar collection, Born to Shine, Dazzling Darling, Keep It Sassy, Sweet But Fierce, and With Grace. And this, my friends, 
is what that looks like. We will go ahead and take out the wax and sniff it. Look how cute this bag is, though. That's a perfect gift for somebody. It is. Perfect. It's already wrapped. It's you a... need a twenty-five dollar gift. We got Grab you. a bag of wax. Mm -hmm. Spend a couple extra dollars for tax, and you might have to pay shipping. But still, I am so excited to smell these. All right, with Grace. This is the first bar. It is a pink bar. Mm. Ooh, that's really nice. Can y'all smell? <laughs> I have it as a speaker so you can smell. Alluring Ooh. gardenia blossoms and sweet pink peony dance delicately with hints of soft musk. Powdery floral. Very powdery. Yep. It, it is like baby powder floral, but not overbearing no, baby powder. Nice. It is just that real nice. A baby's room. That would be good for a baby's room. Oh, that's One, really nice. two cubes, and it would make it smell very, very nice in there. So that's with Grace. The next one is Sweet But Fierce. Which this is, I think this has the prettiest packaging on the front. I don't I know. know if it's purple. This is not, this is not my favorite packaging yet. Uh, well, I know which one yours is. We'll get to. It's these two. Oh. This one's really mild. This one, I think when it's warmed, mm. it doesn't seem like one that's going to throw. It's, it seems like it's going to be one of those that's going to smell nice as it's melting but then it's going to probably lose it do you get vanilla mm -hmm. so this one is some... soothing pink jasmine and sweet violet get bold with a burst of crystallized sugar so i think her vanilla is that sugar some perfume a little bit of perfume mm -hmm. and sh and uh, vanilla which is it's the not, sugar. you know what this one is perfumey it is but it's a mild perfume it's it finishes nice. sweet, mm -hmm. but right there at the beginning, it's it's got some perfume to it. It's nice. I like it. I don't think it's going to be a strong, powerful. These are really pretty packaging. They are. So that's sweet, but fierce. The next one is Keep It Sassy. This one, I like the packaging because it has the high heel tubes. The stiletto pumps. Pump. Pumps. If I remember correctly, when I first saw this, I thought it had two pairs of shoes with the heels in the back, but I could be mixing it up with something else. I don't know. I just remember seeing that in one of the pictures for mm -hmm. some reason. Mm -hmm. This is floral. 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 Like corduroy. Like corduroy. Oh, it's got roses on them. Ooh. I'm not sure I like it. I have to be honest. But it's floral. It might be like it a... It smells like lotion. Like a floral lotion. Like roses, maybe. Mm -hmm. Like a bunch of roses. But not a... You know how some roses smell amazing and other roses just kind of... Meh. This is kind of sweet. So, playful sparkling lemon brings out the sweet side of cherry blossom and sugar cane. I didn't... Really get the. I mean, I got sweet. But, yeah. All right, our next one. This is another one of my favorite packaging: sunglasses, pearls, lipsticks. Lipstick. Yeah. Ooh, this reminds me of a cocktail. Mm. Kind of. Kind of reminds me of a beer. Ooh, is it heavy IPA beers? The citrus, citrus hop. Yeah. It kind of reminds me of a cocktail. Kind of reminds me of having a beer that's got that heavy this grapefruit. Is sweet. There is grapefruit. It's bitey. It has that tart. Mm, this is nice. So far, this is my favorite. Salted grapefruit catches some rays besides sparkling coastal water and calming beach sage. That ring light stuff, though. And finally, our last one. I love the name Born to Shine. This one. I like the color of this 
The color is very pretty. Mild. Yeah, it's very, very mild. Oh. I don't smell anything. Maybe an orange. Maybe it's because it's the color orange. Maybe. That it makes me feel like I'm smelling an orange. Nectarine and pear blossom boldly take center stage while cashmere musk offers a warm, enlivening encore. I don't smell anything. It's mild. It's super but mild. But the color orange. So, again, this one, we could melt it, and it might be a little bit stronger, but for right now, I have to tell you guys, it's it's very mild. So, out of five bars, I'm going to say four out of the five, I would say, are pretty darn good. This one's the strongest one. Actually, three out of the five for me, because one of them, I said, the one that's kind of rosy. I was like, yeah, I'm not so sure. My grapefruit is kicking in there. Okay. So, this $25... Or you can do the thirty dollars and get six bars. But yeah, you can do them individually. Six dollars each. Twenty-five for twenty-five. It's a pretty good deal. Okay, and last but definitely not least, this. Yeah. All right, we got to make some room here. Real quick, clean up a little bit. Here we go. So last but not least, we have a six pack of wax and a warmer for one of our customers. So her six pack choice was an apple butter frosting. It's brilliant, by the way. It is. She has, when she, she sent me her order for her wax, I was just like, oh my gosh, you got amazing fragrances. Yep. This apple butter frosting, it is, it reminds me, I don't know if you guys have ever had it's a dessert. This is going to be really funny. This is going to take y'all back. If y'all have ever had a TV dinner and in those, it was a hungry man TV dinner, if I'm not mistaken. And it had a little tiny dessert that was this apple thing. And it had little tiny squares of apples. That's what this apple butter frosting reminds me of. Really? Yes. I don't know what it is. Just now when I, I smelled it. That. Well, probably not. When I asked your dad if he ever had. He may have. When I smell this, it just took me back to that little tiny dessert. And it had kind of like a like a, like a, a crust over the top. Okay. Not a crumble. It was a crust. But I used to love that thing. It was, that was my favorite thing. That's so funny. A bar of pumpkin chai. Which, Smells amazing. Yep. Y'all, if you're ready for pumpkin, this is it. So fantastic. This is nice. So it has a little bit of salty. It's it's nice. It's nice. Cinnamon buttercream. Again, this is from the new collection, and we have raved about this bar. They make me I want to bake. I smell whipped cream in there. Yep. I was thinking about baking chocolate chip cookies today, and I mm. picture these puffy chocolate chip cookies that just... Yeah. Are amazing with pecans. That's what sounded good. Blue sage and tonka. This is one of my favorites right now. Yeah. If it's not a foodie, it's this one. I'm very big into the foodie smell. So nice. I like foodie and I like so clean. Pretty. I'm not big on floral. I like fruity. Graham cracker crunch. Again, amazing. Put that. With the apple butter frosting, oh. and you got the whole pie. <laughs> mm, and then so finally, good. eucalyptus wreath. That's another good one. And remember, if you watched previous videos of ours, I talk about going to Monterey, and there's this landing, if you would. Canopy. Uh, it's a canopy of eucalyptus trees on both sides of the highway. It's amazing. And it's you, especially because it's so cool down there, it's always like 70 degrees or below. Rarely ever is it greater than that, and it just smells. That is so nice. Oh, that's yeah. good. That That's a good bathroom smell. I like it. All right. So, huh? oh. so all the rave, well, part of all the rave, has been the Shining Light Warmer. And I have to tell you guys, when I saw it in the catalog, I was not a big fan. And 
I'm real funny. I see things. I'm like, man, whatever. And then six months later, somebody posts yeah. a picture of it, and I'm just like, oh my gosh, I need to have that. So, so here we are. That was one of the situations, of course. What's the matter? Nothing. I'm just looking. And one of my customers needed one also. These these warmers are packaged amazingly. So this one is a four cube dish. Four cubes. This is the top of this lantern, and I know exactly where this is going to go already. Hard to get to place, but it's going to go up there. This comes with a 40-watt Edison bulb. This side up. I wonder if it's two different sizes. Mm. The only way to find out is do it wrong. Right. Not right, mm -hmm. wrong. form is also metal and it has a glass sleeve and I cannot wait to plug it in for you. Oh, boy. Can you try and get that apart Absolutely. please? I was having issues. No problem. We don't prep our box unboxings. No. So y'all get to see all the challenges. All the raw. We prepare you for, <laughs> for what's to come. I've had situations where I've, it was a stargaze warmer. I plugged it in and it didn't work because I didn't have my bulb in right. Oh, sorry. No, no, you're fine. No, no, it's supposed to be. 40 watt bulb. Right? Mm -hmm. Edison. So funny, it's a big, bu those bulbs are so pretty. I love those. Those are my favorite. Always keep all the things back in the box. Sorry for the clanking. Oh. Whoa, sorry. I'm gonna go inside there. And we'll take the paper off, but for demo purposes. Okay. You ready, Gretch? I'm ready. This looks so pretty. It is absolutely beautiful. This kind of reminds me of way back when, when you had those porch lanterns. Yeah. That's it's what this so reminds unique. me of. It's and beautiful. I like the Victorian elegant mm -hmm. look of it. Yeah. It's very warm. That's my favorite color of bulb is the, the yellow warm look. So there you have it. What's the price point mm. of this guy? Eighty. Yeah, no. I think it's eighty, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. So we're gonna look it up for you really quick. It holds four cubes, up to four cubes. I don't think we ever max them out. She lies. I do. I don't <laughs> think I ever max them out. Let's see here. $60 price point. Sorry. I don't know where I got 80 from. So it's metal, but it has a glass sleeve to keep that heat. And then your fragrance will go out the top. You got four squares cut out. It's beautiful. Shining light warmer. It is a dust collector. I will tell y'all because I'm just looking at it and I see the dust. Click on it. See if it says anything about it. Architectural design meets dazzling beauty in this modern warmer reminiscent of a mission style lantern. It is 10 inches tall, and as we stated earlier, it has a 40-watt Edison bulb. It's got legs, too. Oops. Nice little lid. Beautiful. Yeah, it's, it's very pretty. So the glass has texture. So it's kind of like um, dimply, I guess you could say. I don't know mm -hmm. how you would describe it. I would, describe, I would it. describe it as bumpy. It's bumpy. <laughs> But dimply is more appropriate, I think. Sure. You know. It has outward dimples. It's beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. I like it very so, much. So, 
if you are not a Scentsy consultant and you don't already have one and you would like to add this to your collection, shoot us an email or start a collection. This is absolutely beautiful. All right. With that, if you like what you saw, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications for future uploads of our videos. If you are new to our channel, welcome. Welcome. If you have watched this far, drop a lantern emoji in the comments section. And thank you for watching. God bless. Have a good night, everybody.